a few months ago, I made a video talking about, uh... I made a troll video talking about games that would supposedly delete your account on Roblox if you joined them. A few days ago, that actually became a thing. I won't show you the game. I'm just gonna try to cross out names to make this like a little bit harder to search. It all started with this. WARNING! PUBLIC SERVICE ANNOUNCEMENT! Joining this game will ban your Roblox account off the platform. The game is using a new technology to effectively trick the Roblox automatic moderation system into thinking you! You! Your account said extremely terrible things. Do not join this game. My favorite part about this tweet is that, uh, it made so many people join this game. When you tell someone, oh, don't look this up, please. You can't look this up. Something bad will happen. I'm gonna look it up. I'm not saying for the people to look stuff up, but like, it makes people want to search it. I crossed out the name here, but, uh, I get that they kind of had no choice because they have to tell you what game it is so you avoid it because people were sending this game to people, making them join it, and then their account would get banned. I have a clip of what the game would do. Whoever's editing this is gonna have a lot of work, uh, censoring stuff out. But yeah, this tweet's just funny. It's like, see this game right here? Don't join it. No, you don't want to see what happens if when you get banned. <laughs> Chase Rooney, I heard that this game actually gives free Robux. I'm going to join it. Oh, that that's good. You can always rely on Chase. But that, that's what would happen. Someone would say something like that. Someone would join the game and their account would be deleted. This happened to so many people. Let me find one. It would make you join the game. It would kick you out. You would refresh the page and then it would, uh, you'd be banned. They would basically write the most horrible things you could ever think of. And Roblox's moderation would automatically delete your account because it thinks you said that. But the game would make you say that. They undid all these, I think. I'm only making a video about it because I think they fully solved the problem now in my old admin videos i had an admin command where i can make people talk i don't think i used it that often because uh it could get people banned like there was one that actually made people like chat things that one i hardly used yeah right here i'm doing the talk admin command for myself there's a more advanced one that makes it actually uh talk as you game doesn't show up in the chat no Oh, wait. Yeah, it was that one. See, I shouldn't have done that. I think at the time, I didn't know it could get people banned, so eventually I stopped. <laughs> I didn't say horrible things, though. That game would do that same thing to your character and make you say horrible things. I didn't type this. The game made me do it. The strange thing about this is I feel like this has been a thing for a really long time. Nobody ever did it like that, but my account literally got permanently deleted because of the same virus or like a similar virus that turned my game I made. It turned my game into a bad thing and it made me look like I was making bad things. I didn't do anything wrong. The, the hacker put that in the game. Yeah. Don't like send Roblox like hate or anything. Oh, that was so nice of me to ask Roblox not or ask people not to send Roblox hate. <laughs> How the times have changed, man. <laughs> I'm kidding, Roblox. I'm kidding. I've explained this a million times, though. Basically, I made a Roblox game, and uh, when I was making this game, I had to be really careful of it. Uh, when I got this casket, I just typed in funeral on here. Any one of these can have uh, codes and, like, look, has scripts in it. This one did, so I felt safe using it. But one like this, look, those could be viruses. That's why Roblox has that warning right there saying it has scripts. Those could uh, turn this game into something horrible. Obviously not all of them, but uh, if you take the risk of using uh, something someone else made, uh, they can uh, just put a virus in your game. It's happened to me multiple times. And then you get deleted for it. And it's a really hard situation to explain. How are you gonna tell Roblox, Oh, a hacker put that in my game. I didn't do all that. I had video proof of it. So that's the only reason why I got unbanned. So for some of these people, it's probably gonna be hard to prove that they didn't say the thing. You know what I mean? I thought this was kind of extreme. It is highly advised to, to turn your Roblox chat off. Guys, don't, don't, nobody breathe challenge. You know what they should have done right after this? They should have tweeted out. Hey guys, let's come hang out. And then they should have tweeted out one of those games that get your account deleted. <laughs> You know, I think this actually happened before. Maybe like a couple years ago where a lot of YouTubers accounts were getting permanently banned. Yeah, this. 2019. Oh yeah, and I had to censor out the reason because I didn't want anyone to think I did that. I think it came from like a random game that uh, a few people joined. Yeah, I think it was some inappropriate game. Or like maybe they made it inappropriate. I'm not joining those types of games. I swear. I think they just decided to ban everyone who joined a specific game. That's kind of the same thing of what, what was going on the other day. I was gonna... Well, okay. 
I can't say this, but I was thinking about joining the game because for me, I would get unperma banned, so it wouldn't really matter. It would be a funny screenshot seeing my game banned, but just because of the stuff the game makes you say, I didn't I didn't feel comfortable joining it, even though nobody would ever see it. And I think uh, generally they would ban every account associated with your computer if you said those types of things that the game was making you say. Man, if I really... <laughs> If I really wanted to, I could turn my follow on, just keep joining new servers of that game. Just filling them up with people. 100 player servers instantly fills up. 99 of you banned forever. I wouldn't do that. Would it make a good video? Yes. Would it make a great video? Yes. Would it be the greatest heist I've ever pulled off? Yes. Should Roblox keep me in this award show? Uh, yes, of course. I wouldn't do anything bad. You know, this whole situation really makes me want to sell my Roblox stock. I still have some Roblox stock. Over the past month, things have gotten a little bit better. Not that much better, but man, the, the way Roblox is uh, keeps screwing up, I feel like this is gonna, I feel like it's, we're gonna reach new lows of the stock. But see what Golden Ninja 50 has to say about this new update, the new ban your count. This guy's channel is epic. He uh, <laughs> he just makes videos where he lies. Get yeah, he's free now. He is reporting on the situation. I need to hear his opinion. Do not join any small games or any games that have a low player count. Do not join any games. Any game that doesn't have a zillion players, don't join it. This is why I don't shop from small businesses. I only support corporate overlords like Walmart. Megan banned from Roblox, but Megan uh got banned for hitting her fans really hard. At a fan meetup, she hit, she punched her fans so hard, and there's a video out there of it. I took the video. Six Roblox YouTubers that got banned for ever. Why did you make my shirt green? Also, what happened? What happened to my eyes? Why are they so bloodshot, huh? I feel like there's something more than crying going on here. I don't remember this. Maybe there's a reason I don't remember it. Roblox account got banned for a weird reason. The moderator left a note that his content is not appropriate. Hate speech is not permitted. Whoa, 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 clarify. There was no hate speech in that video. I think he forgot to say that, that, uh, that there was no hate speech. He was just like, yeah, Flamingo got banned forever for hate speech. It's kind of weird, right? They made a mistake banning me. I got unbanned. No hate speech. <laughs> I kind of feel bad for Roblox. I feel like they're only in the, like, the main mainstream news for uh, really bad things. See, back in the day when something bad would happen on Roblox, uh, nobody knew what Roblox was. So uh, it just kind of got swept under the rug. That was a beautiful time. And I think Roblox got too big too fast to where they didn't cover all the holes in the system. Now they're so popular, everything becomes a, a big deal, which it should be. That was a bad thing that happened. They wrote some bad things uh, on to get people banned. <laughs> Deleted. I don't think you really have to worry about it in the future. I think this is kind of a freak accident. And I feel like this situation could have been resolved so much more quietly instead of like, don't play this right here. Here's a link to it. Avoid this at all costs. How do you keep your account safe? Don't play Roblox. Lock your doors, board up your windows. Everyone is an enemy. Your neighbors want to kill you. You know, all those things, that's what I would say about how to, how to protect themselves in this situation. I think you're gonna be fine. But if you're not fine, it's not my fault.